the warden's outside, like directly outside my window fixing his car and I really don't want him to see me filming. Oh well, let's ignore him. <laughs> I'm going to be staring at him the entire time. Hey guys, so it's April and today I thought I would write out my Christmas list because I messaged my mum um, like a week ago because um, last year she told me that that would be the last that that year it would be the last time I could write a Christmas list because since I'd been an adult like this year I'm 18 um, you know Santa doesn't deliver toys or not toys oh god Santa doesn't deliver things to adults okay I'm gonna shut that curtain there it's half shut and um, so anyway so yeah so last week I messaged my mum asking if Santa would still not like a Christmas list this year. So my mum messaged me back telling me that Santa already has some ideas in mind for um, um, for um, what he's getting me and he's also got quite a few things in his sleigh already. So, but she did say if I write out a Christmas list she'll pass it on to Santa Claus and he'll probably take it into consideration. So since I'm probably not supposed to be getting in this year at all um, I thought nothing too expensive you know I'm not putting anything on my Christmas list like an iPhone so I've been writing things out that aren't as expensive as like an iPhone but still quite good and I'd get use out of okay so I'm gonna tell you what I've written on my Christmas list and if you still haven't written your Christmas list out which you should have because it's getting late um, Here's some ideas, okay? Because this is what I want. Hopefully I'll get most of it, although I doubt I will. And also if you're one of my friends in real life, then this is a great idea of what you can buy me, okay? Like you're more than welcome to buy me multiples of all these things because, you know, you love me. Okay, so first we have number seven makeup. I put that as a heading because I love number seven. If you're um, if you've been subscribed to me for quite a long time, you'll know I absolutely adore number seven makeup. Like, and I don't get sponsored by it, but I think that'd be like a dream because all I ever do is wear number seven makeup. Like, the tiny bit of makeup that I'm wearing now is number seven. Sorry, my hair's a mess. Just just remembered I didn't do my hair. Like I straightened it this morning, but didn't do anything with it. So oops. Um. So anyway, yeah, number seven makeup. Within that, I want foundation. I've written that time warm ivory. Um, my foundation's from warm ivory. You know that that's the shade, so my mum knows what to tell Santa. I also want some blusher because I've never had blusher before. Um, because my mum's always said that it won't look right on me because my skin tone, but I'd still like some anyway. Okay, just to seek it for myself if I like it. I've also got some bronzer. Because I like bronzer, everyone says I look quite nice wearing bronzer, I'm not wearing it currently. Because um, I've got dark skin, I don't quite suit to, um, blusher, but I suit bronzer apparently. Um, but I'm not I'm not really running out, but it's still nice to have. Um, I've got primer down there, because I've not had primer for like months on end, because it's expensive. and yeah. Primer's just basically something that goes beneath all your makeup to keep it on. Um, I also want some lipstick, I've not said what shade or anything, just surprise me. Um, I want some day and night cream because I love number 7 day cream and I love number 7 night cream. And I do like that difference, I don't like having just plain blank moisturiser, I do like some that's made specifically for day and specifically for night. I also like their face wash because it like comes out in a pump, I'll show you because I've got some. I know the bottle is still practically full, but it's nice to have more. And I love it, because it like comes out all foamy, if you can see. And I just love it. And it smells so nice and clean. And where am I going to wipe this off now? And yeah, I just love it. It's just lovely. It's lovely stuff. And, oh, I just adore it. I'm sorry. Um, 
I've also got eyeliner down there because I love number seven eyeliner. I don't know why, but it's just, it's probably the best brand of eyeliner I've ever actually had. It goes on so easily. It's lovely. I tend to use pencil eyeliner. I don't use um, liquid eyeliner. Um, I also, also set, that's the makeup. That's the number seven makeup section finished. Then I wrote, sorry, of the noise. The light, the light turns off automatically and the fan's making a noise. So anyway, next we have Dan and Phil Go Outside, which is a book because it's their newest book and I want it because I'm still a bit of a Dan and Phil fan because I'm young at heart. So that's down on the list because <laughs> um, it's also quite expensive. I don't really want to buy buying it. Um, next we have storage boxes because my room's a state because I have nowhere to put anything. So with I want storage boxes lots of different sizes, some really pretty ones. So um, hopefully it's easier to just store things and everything will look tidy. Like have you seen up there? It's such a mess. Like seriously. Letters everywhere. I don't even have anywhere to put my fucking letters. Apart from on a pile. Don't look very good. Next we have mascara. That's not on the number seven list for the reason that I'm not fond of number seven mascara. That's not a criticism because I love every single other thing that's number seven. But I just the mascara isn't the best in my opinion. It's like the only thing that isn't brilliant about number seven. Just just the mascara. But I do quite like the rest. Um, I also um, I also run out of mascara very very quickly because it's one of the main pieces of makeup that I put on. If I had to choose one thing to put on, I, it would be mascara. Next is nail polish. I haven't put what colour because I don't mind. I just like nail polish in general. I don't care what colour it is. Could, I could have words with the same colour. I don't mind. I just like having it. And I also run out of nail polish very quickly because I mess up very easily. <laughs> so I have to take it off, put it back on, and um, it's just stupid. Um, next on the list we have money. <laughs> I wouldn't say how much because I don't want to be too cheeky, I feel cheeky enough asking for money but it would come in handy since I'm a university student so I have like, I have to pay for food and also if I want to go out with friends, you know, I need money for that um, yeah, just money in general would be very 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 nice and handy and would probably go in a week but still it'd really up the standards of my living condition <laughs> Next we have makeup brushes because I never actually had proper make good, good makeup brushes. The only actual decent makeup brush I have is um, I've forgotten the name of the company now. Bare, Minimor Bare, Ni Bare Minerals. I have a Bare Minerals but brush that I got in like a tip, and um, that's a really good brush. But it's the only brush I have, so I put down makeup brushes because I tend to put like my foundation on by hand and things like that because any other brush I've had is cheap and just didn't work. My hands worked better. <laughs> that didn't quite come out very good. So next. Next we have a bag. I put bag to carry a person on a normal day. So basically not a nighttime bag, not a big bag for college or slash university. I just want a normal nice little bag like that big that's pretty that I can just maybe cross body so I can just put it all on when I'm off shopping okay I think that's nice and um, the only daytime bag I really have is my college my university bag a really small black bag for going out and a nice big pink one that's good for every day but the issue is I don't like taking big bags into shops because I feel like I feel like they're watching me, I feel like I feel like they might think I'm stealing or something, do you get what I mean? It's the same if I go in with a rucksack, it's it just oh I want a small bag. <laughs> Next I have t shirts, jeans, onesie, pajamas and bed socks. <laughs> so basically just essentials. <laughs> I think it'd be a good idea to have them things because my t-shirts are getting a bit worn out, my jeans are wear wearing out, my jeans wear out very fast because of that so my legs like rub together and it just creates holes very quickly 
um, even if I get really good quality stuff. Um, I'm, I'm, I really like Marks and Spencer's jeans, they're my favourite jeans. I put onesie because I love onesies and I could do with another onesie because I haven't had one in ages. Um, I do prefer fluffy onesies that represent like animals. <laughs> um, pyjamas because I love pyjamas and they're wearing out a bit. And bed socks because I don't have many bed socks because I always lose them and I love bed socks. I don't really want to be lying in bed with my um, slippers on, it just doesn't feel right to me. Next I have Xbox games. So I have an Xbox, I only have three games. Or two games. I think I only have two games. No, I have three games. I have Grand Theft Auto 5, I have Minecraft and I have Tomb Raider. Um, I didn't put what games because I thought it'd be a cool experiment to see what my mum gets me. Like if she gets me a childish game like oh look after your own baby or raise a teddy bear or something or if she gets me a proper like shooting mass murder game <laughs> I want to see what she comes up with I'm not going to tell her what game to get even if she asks um, There's also eyeshadow because I don't have many eyeshadow so like at all so I thought that might be a good idea to do because I like wearing eyeshadow but I only have like one eyeshadow, one decent eyeshadow anyway. And finally we have body moisturiser because I don't I've run out of body moisturiser and I don't and I like having a moisturised body. <laughs> Basically. So that's pretty much my entire Christmas list. So if you enjoyed this video and it helped you out, please don't forget to like the video. Um, and subscribe if you're new, you know, if you've not seen my videos before, don't forget to subscribe because it means a lot to me, it really does, it, like, even just seeing my subscriber count go up by one, it just compels me to make so many more videos, and then, um, also, don't forget to comment to let me know your opinions down below, because if you tell me what's wrong with my videos, give me criticism, I can improve on them. If you enjoy my videos and you tell me, it gives me a lot of happiness and I'll want to make more. So yeah, don't forget to tell me what you think to the video, and if you found it helpful as well. Thank you very much for watching guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.